Hey, this is Good Money Stewart coming back at you with part two on hump day, which is Wednesday. Woo! I think it's the 18th. <laughs> I hope it is. I think it is. I think it's Wednesday, October 18th. But anyway, hope everybody's day has been good. It's been good for me. Can't complain. Won't complain. You don't care anyway, so I'm not going to bore you with that. So, if you like my channel, give me a thumbs up. If you don't like it, thumbs down. But by all means, if you do like it, push that button below and subscribe to my channel. And by doing so, when I upload a new video, you will get it and be able to see it. So again, as I say all the time, I am grateful for the viewers that I have that are watching my channel out of Omaha, Nebraska. I'm thankful that I found out that there are other ladies within Omaha that are also doing um, uh, hauls, whether it be Dollar Tree, uh, uh, Marshalls, Family Dollar. We're doing hauls here too in Omaha, Nebraska. Hi again, Mary Beth. Okay, let's get started here. These are kind of food items that I'm going to do. And like I said, I got stuff scattered everywhere. This room is just, I'm glad you can't really see it. Okay, these are the straws I like to use. And they are the 80 count. These, and I like because they're in the uh, neon colors. These are the ones that you can stretch and they're really long because I was buying the shorter ones and they weren't going all the way down in my cup. And so I found these and I really love them. So if you're looking for the longer straws, you have to get the ones that are in the 80 count. The other ones that are bigger, they're, they're the shorter ones. So, and who is this by? This is by Home Store. That is who makes these, Home Store. Okay. And we had Sloppy Joe's yesterday, and these are by Lay's, and we love the sour cream, and they're always good. So I grabbed this, and then forgot I had them because they were down here in the room. So we will be eating these tonight. I heard Miss Black Go talk about this. Uh, she uses with her boys when they're making their pizza, and it is Rinalde. Uh, France, Francisco Rinalde pizza sauce. This is a 14 ounce bottle. The expiration date on here, if I can find it. Okay, I don't see it. I might just be overlooking it, guys. But I'm sure it's a pretty up to date. I don't really get crazy about those things. Uh, I have yet to ever get anything. Oh, here we go. Uh, it is best used by uh, 5119 and it's right I don't know if you can read that but there we go and so she says she also uses these Camillo's pizza crust and I like them because they're little and there's two in a pack and it's seven ounces and this is a seven inch pie I'm sorry pizza crust and so me and Juliana are gonna give these a try and see how good they are trying to see an expiration date on here because some people really like to know that but I don't see it so I'm not gonna worry about it okay so that's a good deal right there then I found these uh, grinders this one is sea salt and this one is a black pepper this first time I've hauled these because usually they are sold out and I can't find them and it says best used by 2019. So, and I'm trying to see the maker on here. I guess I don't see it. I don't see it on here. But this is the pepper one. And this is the sea salt one. So I was glad to find those. And then I got this paste, uh, picante sauce. This is the Mayo. I love this stuff. And it was only a dollar. You try to buy it at the uh, store. You may pay a little, like two dollars or so for it. But um, that's cool. And I'm trying to look for the expiration. You know, they're making these expiration dates harder to read. Sometimes they do them on the glass. And you can't read the glass because it's printed in there. But that is uh, some of the food stuff I got. Let me put this away and then... I'll start with another bag. Just trying to keep where everything is not so cluttered up. Okay, I found these coffee cups, which I really, really love. 
These are by Home Store Insulated Cups. There's five in here with the lids for six, and they're 16 ounces. I love these. I have used them before, and they are really, really good, guys. So I got one in this design, and then I got one in this design. I like this design better because it looks like you actually went to some coffee shop and got some coffee. And you know the last time I got these, they even had the uh, cardboard that went around them. I don't know if they have, because this is a different brand, but I got two of those. Okay, I think that is all my food. I showed those already. Okay, I did happen to get some more of these. I just can't get enough of these. Oh, they are the festive cheer. They are the little mailboxes. And they are just so cute. So the, th that was a rebuy. And I did buy the same one. So I'm not going to show all of those. But that's that. Okay. I'm going to go ahead and show this. I remember the first time I ever saw this product. Didn't know what it was. So I, I ignored it. I thought, oh, it can't be good. Can't be good. It's in the Dollar Tree. Well, I was wrong. And I have kicked myself for that, and I have kicked myself for that. So I said, the next time I see this stuff, I'm getting it. <sighs> now, I've been able to buy some hit and miss, but not with the whole product. Well, yesterday, I was able. Was it yesterday? Was it? No, it was Monday. I was able. No, not Monday. It was Tuesday. I'm sorry. My day's some down. I, I, I did a haul, honey. <laughs> did a haul. Okay. It is the Bolero product. And Sister Girl was like a little kid in the candy store. I found the body oil. And they're all in vanilla, guys. This is vanilla cream. And this is formula number 348. Face, skin, and hair body oil by Bolero. And I like that they did them in the fall colors. This is so nice. So I got three of these. Then I did the facial wipes, vanilla cream, um, 30 count in each of these. I got three of these. I can't find the other one, but it's down in this bag. Then I got the bath fizz, fizzers. And remember, they are all in vanilla cream, which is fine with me. These are the fizzers. Okay, then I got, oh, here's the other one. Oh, no, I actually got four of those. I don't know why I got four of those. Oh, jeez. Okay, so. Then, you know what? I'm, where's my other bag at? Don't make me get mad now, because I know I got it. I got the Fizzing Bath Bombs. Now, this is lavender and sea salt. These are big sizes, too. This is what that looks like. You know, is this by... Yeah, it's by Valero. Yes. So I got three of those. I got two of more lavender, and then this one is almond, milk, and honey. Okay. You know what? I got another bag around here with this stuff in it somewhere, but, okay, there's my third bag for that. And then I got three of these. This is the hand wash. Vanilla cream is 13.5 ounces, and um, I got three of those. So, you know what? Somebody about to get blessed. Now, let me see. Got, oh, here's my other bag. Oh, here it is. Here it is. Here it is. Okay, I want to make sure. Oh, my God. I was about to miss some stuff. This is the bath soaps. What time? Okay. This is the bath soaps. Vanilla cream. This is a 17.5 ounce bottle. Okay. This is the bath wash. Vanilla again. 
and this is a 13.5 okay got three of those oh my gosh then I got the vanilla cream uh, body cream and this is a 3.5 I just love the color I mean these are just this is nice so when you see this don't mess around get it because you may not see it again what is this oh I did that okay so that is my Valero haul right there I'm gonna stop with this because I gotta clean this off so I can do another haul but I you know what I just kind of prayed I said Lord I really really would like to get that and as I say all the time I get this stuff I just don't hoard it I'm a person that likes to bless people I love to bless people. So you get you see all this stuff and she says she's getting all that stuff and she's not giving it away. Well, see, you don't know that. I give stuff away. It might not be, you know, to some of the haulers, which I have, but there's people that I know that I've worked with. And sometimes God just lays things on my heart. I may not even know you. And he puts you on my heart. I'm going to bless you with something. So my thing is, it's better to give than to always have your hands out. That's the way I feel. Because in doing so, I know it's going to come back to me. So with that, I'm grateful that I can be able to give, not respecting, not expecting anything in return because it's going to come back anyway. So with that, I'm going to shut this haul down and I'll be back with part three because I got to show you all this stuff today. I'm going to not put this off anymore. So you be blessed. And until next time, this is Good Money Stewart. Bye-bye.